Welcome Brainers! Typically, Windows-based PCs do not come with a shortcut that enables users to easily turn off their monitors. In this video, I'm going to show you the simplest method for setting up a keyboard shortcut that can turn off your screen. Without further ado, let's jump straight into it. Please right-click on an empty area on the desktop. Select New from the context menu that appears. Click on Shortcut. Copy this command from the video description and paste it over here in the Create Shortcut wizard. Please click Next. Enter a name of your choice for the shortcut. Click Finish. Right-click on the new shortcut you've created and select Properties. Click on the Shortcut tab. Please tap inside the shortcut key field and then press the key combination that you want to use. It's purely your choice, but some of the key combinations do not show up here because those are reserved or already in use. Let me set it as Control alt m Once you've entered the key combination, click Apply and then OK to save the changes. From now on, if I press Control alt m my monitor should turn off. Let's check it out. Wow, it works! You can restore your screen by either moving your mouse or pressing any key on your keyboard. Sometimes your keyboard is away, you can even do it with your mouse. Just double-click the shortcut icon. Cool! All works as expected. Now some of you may want to lock before turning off the screen. The process is a little different because of the shortcut command length limitations. Please search and open Notepad. Copy these lines from the video description and paste them over here in the Notepad. Save the file by clicking on File and then Save As. Please type the name you want to use and make sure to include the .bat extension at the end of the file name. In the Save As Type dropdown, select All Files. This will ensure that the file is saved as a .bat file and not a text file. Click the Save button to save the file. That's it. Simply double-click the .bat file, your monitor will be locked and turned off. You can get your screen back by either moving your mouse or pressing any key on your keyboard. Unlike last time, now you will need to supply the credentials to unlock your computer. We can also create a keyboard shortcut. Please right-click on the .bat file and select Create Shortcut. You will see a new file in the same directory with the same name as the .bat file, but with the word shortcut added to the end. Right-click on the shortcut file and select Properties. Click in the Shortcut Key field and press the combination of keys you want to use as a shortcut. Tap on Apply and OK to save the changes. That's it. You have now created a keyboard shortcut for locking and turning off the monitor. All works well, I hope it was helpful. Please do like the video and subscribe to our channel. If you've any questions or thoughts, please feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another helpful video.